Welcome to the Art of Dress. Today I'm happy to share with you the effect of artistry on sky blue water alternate colors. So thank you so much for coming and subscribing. Here we have the very beautiful Abby Lee Kershaw and she is wearing alternate aqua blue. So this is not her sky blue, but she has sky blue water coloring. And that's what I want to show you today. How does she get to this color? Let's start with the personal color wheel for all sky blue waters. So this just shows you that there are four element colors across the top, the light colors, sort of typical you would think for sky blue water. And then on the bottom right, you see two intense colors. Those are alternates. And that's what we're talking about today. The first influence on alternate colors comes from your style. If you look at this style wheel on the right hand side are the styles where the influence is to intensify colors. And that would include today refined dramatic that's Hailey Bieber and Taylor Swift true gammon. And on the left hand side are the styles where the influence is the opposite to lighten the colors. So here today, what we're looking or talking with or showing is Jennifer Aniston. She's a Labrador classic. And I have two dramatics who happen to be style twins. So that's Abby Lee Kershaw and um, Gemma Ward. And they're both true dramatic. Now, it's not actually enough to know this because the, the colors themselves have something to say. So here's the color wheel showing all of the prime colors of humanity. And we've already worked our way through the, the warm colors on the bottom. This is our second cool color. It is sky blue water. So like aqua blue, all of the colors on top, what happens is there is an, a change in influence. So here where you see style and artistry affect colors on the top of this wheel, you can see off to the side, it says, when you have cool colors as your uh, prime color, the influence reverses itself for alternate colors. So that's the first thing we're going to look at today. And in conjunction with that, we're also going to look at the influence of artistry itself. Composite on the far right up above always is going to be, um, <clears throat> sorry, that's architectural, always warm and always clear composite underneath, always muted, always cool. On the top left, sculptural, always clear for alternate colors and warm in the warm, cool in the cool. And at the bottom left, harmonics, always muted for alternate colors, warm in the cool, cool in the warm. So let me show you our four styles and four artistries. So first we have Gemma Ward. She is wearing the most gorgeous, very clear and intense and also cool aqua, just gorgeous. And now you can compare that with Hailey Bieber. Her aqua is light because she's refined dramatic and her aqua is also slightly muted and slightly cool as well as both of them slightly cool. And now to the warm uh, aquas. Here's Jennifer Aniston, so elaborate classic. So her alternate aqua color is, um, is going to be intense and it is also muted. And because it is a cool color, she wears a warm version. So you can see how this is edging towards Celadon. And then the final is Taylor Swift. And what you see here is because she's true gammon, her aqua is light. And then her intense aqua is a light version of intense aqua. And then it is also, because she's architectural, always clear and always warm. And now let's look at rubies. So first we have Abby Lee Kershaw and her ruby color, as you see, is very, very intense. And that's because she's true dramatic. And then because she is also sculptural, it is clear and warm. And now 
Taylor Swift. So this is a lighter version of Intense Ruby, as you can see. And because she is architectural, it is warm and clear. And now here is Jennifer Aniston. This is intense because as an elaborate classic, her alternate colors are intense and it is cool and it is also muted because she's harmonic. And finally, here is Hailey Bieber. Because she's refined dramatic, her alternate colors are light, lighter. So it's a light version of a strong ruby. And because she is um, composite, always muted and always cool. So thank you so much for sharing this with me today. And we watch the colors unfold. Next, we're going to look at Violet Water. And in the meantime, just to remind you, every week I post new personal, completely personal style information according to your style artistry coloring. You can take the quiz at the website, theartofdress.com and also general discover articles. So I look forward to next week. Thank you again for coming and subscribing. Please take care. Thank you.